Hey, how's it going everyone? It's your boy. Look, I told you that I would be coming back and getting with you guys towards the end of the year. Well, today is December 16. It's about mid month and I wanted to come to you guys and talk to you about our fast that's coming up in January. Look, if you're uninformed or if you're just hearing about it for the first time and you're in this group, we're going to be doing a Daniel fast, a 21 day fast starting on January 2nd. The reason why we're starting on January 2nd is because I want to give you guys the opportunity to enjoy your New Year's Eve and your New Year's Day with your family before we start this fast. Look, during this Daniel fast, we're gonna be putting away some luxury uh, food items that we normally partake in in order to um, devote that time and that energy and that space uh, to cultivate our relationship with God. So if you're still interested in it, um, I'm here for you. Now look, earlier last month, I sent you guys a book in the messenger chat called Daniel Fast for Spiritual Breakthrough. If you haven't already downloaded that book and opened that book, I want you to do it. If you can't do it from Messenger, what I want you to do is DM me your email address and I'll send you a copy of that book to your email address. It's very important. And check this out. Once you download that book, I want you to go into it and read over section one. That's before the new year. And it's very important that you read over section one because it's gonna talk about things like what fasting is. It's gonna talk about what is the Daniel fast, which is the fast we're gonna do. It's gonna talk about why even choose the fast in the first place. It's gonna talk about why make vows, you know, because during our fast, we're gonna be asking God for some stuff and some ways that we want him to move in 2023. So it's gonna ask, why do you even do that? It's going to talk about um, what type of things you can withhold from, um, whether you can withhold from certain foods or for those of you who have strict diets or have health issues and you can't um, really partake in the Daniel Fast, it'll talk about what other type of options you have. It's going to talk about what's the primary focus on our fat of our fast. It's not the food. It's not the food, even though we're abstaining from food, that's not the focus. So read over that part. Lastly, it's going to talk about how to prepare for the fast. That's why I want you to read the book now or research section one now before the fast starts, because it's going to help transition from where we are now into where we want to be when we start our fast. Now, look. There's a lot of things we have planned for the fast, well, that I have planned for us in the fast. So um, stay in this group, pay attention to this group because I'm gonna be putting some things out there and I need you to be a part of it. Yeah, this is a corporate fast, which means we're doing it together. We're gonna be encouraging one another and that's why um, we're all in this thing together. So look, read section one. As we go into the fast and we begin it, we're going to be reading the other section, but we're going to be doing it day by day. There's going to be devotionals. There's going to be um, scriptures and all kinds of things. And every now and then I'm going to be putting little videos shorter than this one <laughs> in the chat um, just to encourage you guys and to see where you are along the way. And then hopefully um, my desire is to do three group Bible studies throughout this fast, one each week um, for 21 days. So that's three weeks in 21 days. Um, so look. I hope you're encouraged. I hope you're still interested. I hope um, you're still motivated. If you're anything like me, um, I got some ways that I need God to move in 2023. I got some things that I need to ask God for in 20, 2023. And, and there's some connections uh, between me and God um, and some places in our relationship that I need to be renewed in 2023. So if that's how I feel, I know you guys probably feel the same way not to mention uh, some of us have had all types of transitions and things come up and, and obstacles and challenges and all kind of stuff throughout the end of 2022 so we need to really hone in come together as a community and focus on restoring our relationship with god look if you are doing something at your home church already you already have something planned i don't want to take you away from that but if you have not found community or you have not already prepared to fast, I want you to consider being a part of this. If you're like, absolutely no, that's not for me. Um, you don't have to remain in this group. You can leave the group. Or if you just want to um, 
participate and, and go over the book and things like that, feel free to do it too. Look, that's all I want to get with you guys for. I don't want to take up too much of your time, but I wanted to let you know that I haven't forgotten and that I still look forward to doing this thing with you. So hope to see you soon. Stay tuned as I give some uh, more detailed instructions probably next week, and uh, we're going to get this thing done. All right, guys. Peace.